very, very happy to uh, receive uh, here in Anambra and at my country home the Chief of Defense Staff, General Irabo. Of course, all of you know him for what he did in the Northeast with the Boko Haram. Great guy. And today he's commanding virtually all the forces. And I'm happy he's here. Uh, we'd like to invite the President to help us sort out our security challenges, you know, and, and um, I've had brief discussions with him, and I want to tell India Nambra that uh, it is not going to be business as usual for the criminals that are here. We're going to deal with them ruthlessly. If a criminal find your, find your way out of this place, find your way out of Nigeria, because that's the point that has been made. The general will also, I don't want to discuss, fact that is we discuss, you know, because it's not, it's not for your information, you know, but uh, just to let you know that we are taking major decisions on what will happen. I want India Namra to sleep with their two eyes closed as usual. Thank you very much. General. Thank you, Excellency. Excellency, gentlemen of the press, good evening. Let me first and foremost thank Your Excellency for receiving me this evening. Um, for some you know, other engagement that I had earlier in the day, I've had to pay this visit a little bit late. I'm here and perhaps for the information of uh, members of the press to consult with His Excellency, His Excellency, the Governor of Anambra State, over the unfolding scenario within the security environment in Anambra State. And we've had very useful discussions and some information, some information information has been exchanged and I'd like to assure His Excellency and of course India Nambra that criminality will be dealt to it with seriousness that it deserves. I like to warn very sternly every criminal that is hibernating within the space of Anambra and of course the large Nigeria to find a different space entirely. We will go after them and ensure that our people live in peace and harmony. This is the assurance I'd like to leave with His Excellency and of course the larger Indian number. Once again, Your Excellency, I'd like to thank you for the very warm reception that you've um, given to me and my team. And I'd like to assure you uh, that uh, in concert with other security agencies, we will ensure that, that peace returns to every new country of Nigeria. Nigeria, we know peace again. Thank you, Your Excellency. Thank you, General.